Let's now talk about space, and this is a live event. The Indian Space Agency, ISRO, is ending the new year with a bang. With its last space mission of the year, ISRO has launched space docking experiment SpadeX mission. This marks a major milestone in India's space exploration efforts. This is a mission that is crucial for India's future space endeavors, such as the Chandrayaan-4 and the Indian Space Station. Space docking is a highly sophisticated feat that has been accomplished only by entities from the US, Russia, Europe and China. The Indian-made twin SpadeX satellites, weighing 220 kilograms each, have been placed in orbit by the Indian workhorse PSLV rocket. The vehicle has lifted off from the first launch pad of the Indian spaceport Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota from India's southeast coast. The satellite will be placed in an orbit that is 470 kilometers above the Earth. Let's just uh, listen a little bit to the space launch. वर्तमान में ग्राउंड स्टेशन हम तक डेटा उपलब्ध करा रहे हैं यान के सभी आंकड़े हम तक टेलीमेट्री डेटा द्वारा प्राप्त किए जाते हैं और उससे हमें अभी यह पता लगा है लेट्स टॉक टू आवर कोरेस्पोंडेंट सिद्धार्थ एमपी हुज जॉइनिंग अस ऑन द लाइन सिद्धार्थ एमपी अनदर माइलस्टोन फॉर इंडिया टेल अस मोर अबाउट दिस स्पेडेक्स मिशन यान अपने उद्देश्य दिशा की Eric, uh, in fact, SpadeX is actually a stepping stone to bigger things. SpadeX is basically like the first step towards building a space station or towards even accomplishing future Indian missions like Chandrayaan-4. Basically, there is a limit on how heavy a uh, satellite or rocket can lift. But if you want to build a space station, you would want to, you know, send multiple building blocks or satellites to space and assemble them in space autonomously. SpadeX is exactly doing that. It's sending two satellites to space. And then autonomously assembling them. So this is how you piece together a space station. This is what uh, the International Space Station has done. This is what the Chinese Tiangong Space Station has done. So India hopes to do this in the coming years, 2028 to 2035. That's when India wants to start building its space station. So this is the fundamental step in that direction, Eric. So you know the mission as we speak is underway, and in about 10 days we can expect the docking to take place. Over to you, Eric. Uh, Siddharth MP, maybe you can talk more about the docking because the, this is being considered as a highly uh, sensitive area and um, India is giving it a chance for the first time ever because the US, Europe and China have done so. How important is the docking of this SpadeX at the uh, International Space Station? Yeah, so Eric, uh, to talk about these SpadeX satellites, both of these are barely the size of a washing machine. There are two satellites. So one will be slightly faster, the other will be, of course, slower. So the slower one will have to adjust itself in a way that it actually travels closer to the faster one. And both of them will have to meet up in space. And believe it or not, the speed they're traveling uh, at in space will be 28,000 kilometers per hour or almost 8 kilometers per second. So that's how blazing fast they'll be. At that time, what they'll have to do is both of these satellites will have to come in parallel. They'll have to meet and perform a handshake. So they can't be faster and they can't be slower. They'll have to be at optimum speed. Both satellites will have to be at the same speed. Going faster also is risky. Going slower also is risky. Both will have to be at the same speed come in line, sync up and then perform what is like a handshake. So imagine if two people are running at 28,000 kilometers per hour and if they have to line up together and then perform a handshake, how uh, you know tough is that? This is exactly what's happening in space and imagine this is fully autonomous. It's just based on commands. They just have to give the command that you start docking and the rest is fully taken care of the satellites, the sensors and the software and the cameras on board. So that is how sophisticated this mission is. And clearly, this is a, you know, really, you know, tough mission for ISRO to accomplish. And, uh, you know, we had termed it in our reportage as the toughest mission for ISRO in orbit around the Earth. Eric. All right. That is Siddharth MP. He's our correspondent. Thank you, Siddharth, for that information. If you're just joining us, this is a live event in India where the ISRO or the Indian Space Agency has just launched space docking experiment called SpadeX mission to the International Space Station. We'll be uh, covering this report for you and give you all the latest updates concerning the SpadeX mission.